Hey guys, IBLT here with a quick follow-up video to my double pulse delay extender contraption that increases the delay between two pulses from a single input. And I want to quickly show you it in action, then I'll explain it a little bit. So it's an etho hopper clock. You can uh, search for that if you don't know how to build it, where you have a single input that cycles the clock one time and the length of the dispenser turning on and it turning off is adjustable by simply adding items to the clock. One input, dispenser on, after a delay, another input, and dispenser off. And I want to quickly show you the off part. So here's what's happening. <clears throat> Excuse me. When you have an input, the dispenser turns on. But if you try to have another input to turn it off, it will not work until this line is no longer powered and now your off can work. So the fix is to do a mono stable circuit like this. And so now when you have your on input, regardless of how long this line is powered, this little contraption here kills the power there so that whenever your off input cycles, it turns it off. And so you just saw me build it. Uh, if you don't use a sticky piston, make sure that you use sand. Otherwise, you can use any movable block on the sticky piston. And you technically don't need that uh, line there. This, oh yeah, see I forgot to turn this off. <laughs> and uh, technically a dispenser has any length, but depending on what you're powering, you might want it two ticks so that it doesn't mess things up. But anyhow, you can figure that out in your own contraptions. One input on, even though it's still on, it breaks the power there so that your off can cycle it off. And so one more time, I will show you here. This powered it on when the clock cycles off. This line stays on, but it's broken there, which enables the input to again turn it on. Pretty basic, but check this out, guys. Observers, I built this before observers. So on, it blinked once. Off, it blinked once. That means that this entire stuff from here on is obsolete. Go away. Do not need you. Do not need you. Don't, don't need you. Gone. Done. All we need is an observer, and the observer could go here, 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 or here, uh, uh, or there. Doesn't matter. I, I'll just put it there. Check this out. Same input on when the clock cycles. Off. Done. So this little observer will fire once when this piston extends and fire once when the piston retracts. So that is an even better fix for 1.13 plus. So there you go. Hopefully this makes sense. If not, uh, hit me up in a message or comment and I'll try to help you get your inventions up and running. Have a good day. Hope to see you some other time. Goodbye.